Hey guys, Briar Rabbit here. Today I want to talk about grinding. So in the last week or so, I have been working on the Chrome Barrel Master 3 Challenge. That means I got to get 850 one-shot kills with the Chrome Barrel attachment on a sniper rifle to finally unlock the ghillie suit. And while I'm far from the first person to unlock the ghillie suit, I was pretty proud of myself. I'm not a sniper rifle player, uh, so it really took me out of my comfort zone in Call of Duty Ghosts. Uh, forced me to use the sniper rifles, and it's something that I wanted. I wanted that ghillie suit. I kind of think it's a pretty cool thing, uh, and I really like how Call of Duty does these challenges. So it takes a long time to unlock some of these things, like the ghillie suit, and we got a lot of them this year with the gold gun challenges, the character camo challenges, all sorts of stuff to unlock this year, and I think that's great. Uh, when I'm feeling a little bit bored with the game, it usually means that I have been... Uh, set into like an assault rifle with extended mags and a silencer and just playing you know that setup over and over again and what I find what the challenges do for me is they force me to switch up my gameplay maybe it's with using new perks to unlock a certain you know hat or mask or something for my character or maybe I want to you know get some gold guns so I start unlocking different guns or start using different guns and completing the challenges for them this year, I'm not psyched about some of the challenges that require you to use that lean feature that they introduced this year. I don't like that lean feature. It promotes camping. Uh, I actually, I'm not so sure if I've got any kills using it. I, I don't use it. It's just not the style of play that I have. And, uh, it's just unnatural to me and I don't want to just be kind of like leaning behind boxes waiting for people to come by so that I can unlock that camo, uh, which you need to do to get the gold camo in Call of Duty or in Ghost. So, I like the challenges overall though. I like how it promotes different styles of play and I like the freshness that it brings to every Call of Duty game. I, and I'm wondering what you guys think about these things. Are they worth doing? Do you like them? Uh, do you wish that they would totally change them up in some way that I haven't or they haven't thought of yet? I'm really interested to hear what you guys think. As you can see, I'm just now realizing that I finally unlocked the Chrome Master 3 achievement and got my ghillie suit. I was pretty psyched about it. I did not see it come up like a pop-up in on the screen when I unlocked it, so I just went back into the operations after the game and found it. So I was pretty excited about that. Let me know what you guys think about the unlockables in Call of Duty, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.